Lawyers for Mexican drug lord El Chapo demanded that their client be allowed to appear in person at his upcoming New York City court appearance Friday after a judge declared he would be present via video conference due to safety concerns. Joaquin Guzman objects to appearing by video, and requests that he be physically present in the courtroom at his next appearance. A letter filed late Monday states, Brooklyn Federal Justice Brian Colgan ordered last Wednesday that Guzman appear via video so as to minimize disruption from physical transportation, or, as one post source put it, save marshals the hassle of dealing with the notorious SKP, who twice sprung himself from Mexican prisons. God forbid they transport him and there's a plan in place by his people to break him free the law enforcement source said, and they get into a shootout in broad daylight with El Chapo's gunman. The letter also stated that the kingpin, who has been held in solitary for 23 hours a day at the Metropolitan Correction Center in Manhattan, could use the change in routine, and that appearing via video would cause prejudicial publicity. His absence from the courtroom would necessarily lead to the public impression that Mr. Guzman is too dangerous to be brought to the courtroom. The filing reads, adding he's been a good boy so far on U.S. soil. Defense counsel is not aware of a single complaint since the United States authorities took custody of Mr. Guzman, suggesting he has been uncooperative or disruptive in any way. The document says, noting the alleged murderer's respectful appearance when he appeared in court on January 20, after being extradited from Mexico to face trial on drug trafficking and other charges.